today we're going to be looking at laying some herringbone brickwork. Yesterday, got the outside built, made this little frame here, all round. Then we start the herringbone, and then today we're going to try and fill that bit in, and then eventually we'll brick up there, but not today. But we've done the hardest bit yesterday by getting these edges in. All right, we're using lime mortar, pre-made, but we'll have a little look at that. Pre-made lime mortar. That's a great idea, but the reality of it is crap. Because when you get it delivered, that comes under some lorry there where you ain't got a crane, and you've got to get it from there to here. The colour, the, the idea of it is good, but the reality of it ain't no good at all. Get the two in really tricky nearly everyone's a cut got one two but six whole ones with all these pretty little bits here it's a little bit trial and error so we mark one and the main man will cut that dry let's have a look that's looking good and we got that little bit there we've got to do later we've got a little bit there that's all cuts fiddly 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 Temp temp. I'd like to see what they say in the book about this. Yeah, sure I think I can shuffle like uh don't do it. <laughs> if it's all possible, avoid. Yeah. Yeah, just got what? Five mil off that, yeah. I think. Is it tea time yet, boss? Close to tea time. It's close to it. Let's get rid of that old stuff now, I think, boss, if we can. Put that there. I'll pass, boss. Oh. Right. Reach for the stars. Right, I've got to go there. Ooh, man. Let's go, go. really gently on this. Get it somewhere in there. Let me put a little bit on the brick. Oh, 
Run up. What's the matter? That might just be a short brick, boss. Yeah. I think it's a short brick. There. That's under there, so there's not a lot we can do with that. If we get that one there, just try it there first. That's pretty good. Oh, wow. Well. Okay. Right, we're getting near the end now. Last three bits of brick. Oh. Put that in there. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> oh, a bit of building humour, you can't be a bit of building humour. <laughs> oh dear. Well, that's true, isn't it? Right, uh. That one, that one, aye, aye. Aye. Get up there, isn't it? Big armour. Bum, ba, 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 Oh man, I should go in there, get it in. Be 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 be. Right, bit of that on there. Ah, oh. oh, noisy so and so. Right, we're nearly there. Got the bulk of it in. Now we've got all the awkward little ditty pieces to go in here. Lots of cuts. Got to end up like that. We get all them in there. And then we can think about pulling that up. Oh, can we get that in there? All right, guys. Okay, all the little pieces are in. Panel's complete. Now we'll leave that to go off. And a little later we'll point it up. And we'll try and scheme the next bit. So we've got the first 
one end of a mitre there and we've had to fix a piece of timber to the wall to stop that falling over. We put a tie in there and I've got to paint the menace on this side to stop it all leaning over. Okay, getting ready to point it up. Got our first bits of brick in there. Ready for when that dry in a few days time. And I got a point all up like that. And we'll brush it when we come back next week. Pointed up, cleaned up. We've done the half. Now we've got to try and recreate the same pattern up the wall there. We made two little formers, a little bit of insulation. And that's got to be our starting point. So let's see how we get on. So what we're doing here is we're cutting all these bricks and all the angles lay it dry to make sure it works on the first course and we never got that. So we're getting the first couple of bits in. Not much swearing at the stage. Squeeze that there, make it go down a bit. Just get a level across. A little gap there, so we'll just move that to there. And we're straight edging off the bits we built earlier. I'll come there. This is the hardest bit setting this up. Well, that dry. That bad boy's got to get in there. Whoop, whoop. Stainless steel, so it's not given. No. Uh, okay. oh. That's that. Man's cutting these little awkward fiddly bits there, look. Three up each side, starting to come, put another one up there. Ooh. Right, we're getting somewhere near the top, so we'll do a little bit more today. Let that go off, then tomorrow we've got a cut out there, ready to create some sort of sill. Here we can see each one's got to be individually marked and cut. There's no quick, easy method to this, it is what it is. Somebody. Anyway, let's have a little look where we're at. So we've got these stainless steel toys fixed in at various points. And we've got them all built in behind here now. And you can see there was that at the bottom there, look. We'll take that out tomorrow. That's the insulation. We'll just cut that out. Then we can fill that in. You can see all the joints there, look. 
we're filled in behind it. So, we're nearly there for today. So it's time for drastic measures. Bring in the beast. It's time for the beast. Starting to point it up, give it the first one, fill all the little gaps in. This stuff will take it tomorrow. Slowly, slowly, whatever they say. You can see there, look, the gaps. And we smooth them in, and we give it another prop point afterwards. Remember, so if you like what you see, subscribe to Building With Bad. There we go. So we'll get that one out. Now we'll get the next one. And this is uh, Steve who's world famous jab saw. Look at that. I got bought one once, but I threw it away. That was useless. So now we took our forms at them little hollers. We put these bricks in there, we cut them dry, and then when they're all cut dry, I'll then go in there and we'll lay them. And we're starting to get a few more on the top. Right, we're getting towards the, the top, so now we set a line up here. So there, and what we'll do, when we get our bricks like that, and we can mark to that, and get on a straight line. Let's see how we get on. Okay, so we're now getting to the nitty gritty. You can see we've got the line set up. And for good fortune, all the bricks are hitting the top of the line. We're now going to cut all these individual ones to create this shape here. Really, the upside down version of that. So, that's looking good. Patience is uh, being pushed to the limits. Remember to subscribe, please. Getting them towards the top. Look. You can see that there. Now do the same there, do the same there. My man will just try that in there. Just try it a couple of times. Yes, there we go. Right, we're nearly there. Got one more little bit to put in that gap there. And they get that in. And we can put the raw stretches across the top. And then we've got some tiles on top of that. So now, you can see we're cutting them. And what we'll do next is we'll just get rid of all this foam here before we go much further. Cut that off. Just remember, you one thing. I can't get enough of We go top course in so we've got a picture frame now heron board and picture frame now that's whatever the customers decide on the top this is what the customers requested these tiles we're having to cut them all got to fit in there we we'll work out from the center and we'll put a piece on the end 
I never got fit in them. I don't particularly enjoy fitting these. Did it when I was a boy, they're horrible then, they're horrible now. But that is what it is. So we're now going to try and put these tiles on the top of that sill here. And what we've got to try and do to help them stick, because that is pathetic, we've got to use an old Indian trick. Hey, 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 oh, and we no. uh, got to put a little bit of glue on there. He said. <coughs> Something like that. Whatever am I doing? 60 years old in this crap. This is what I'm reduced to, mate. <laughs> Look at it. So then we've got to try and stick that on there. Yeah, I see. Over and out. So we've got the same gap all the way through. Look at that. Right, there we go. We've got the corner one on now. We've just got to grope them in there so what we'll do now we'll leave it a little while we'll have a little bit of a clear up then we'll have a good point up yeah something sweet if we just move that level lovely simply lovely well we've got a couple of minutes i'm just going to point out to you when you're using old reclaimed bricks the problems you have with the different sizes Look at that one to that one. That's seven mil longer. That's five. That one's slightly shorter than the longer one. Then that's even longer. Then you got ten mil difference there. That's like really hard to sort out when you look, try to set the gauge up. So we get flush one side and then the other side. Just trying to get your perps up right. It's nearly impossible. That's, you got to give and take and use this sort of stuff. I do apologise for the language in the background. Yeah, a man has cleaned the little tiles. Crappy tiles. <laughs> these are genuine reclaims, these are. Yeah. Yeah. I think I need reclaiming and all. We think they're found in a drive. <laughs> yeah, it's rubble. <laughs> these were rescued from rubble. <laughs> These are shorter than rubber in the drawer. <laughs>